All right, here is the pop-up camper. So I think it's about a 1999 Palomino. Uh, the awning's in good shape. The case is a little crinkly, but it works fine. The canvas all around is in really good shape. And it's gonna have your typical mold on it. We use some spray, cleans it right off. The lines is your electrical. Plug right into uh, your site electric. There's your hitch and propane. You see here, we patched up a little damage in the outer screen. That's common for a unit like this. On the other side, we put an entirely new screen in front of it, so you can't even tell. There's your gas line. This is where you would mount the stove outside. Tires are in pretty good shape, but you could totally get some new ones. Two electrical outside, they both work. The handle doesn't work to open the door. You can replace that easy enough. You just go in from the side like that. Okay, stepping in. I've got it down so you can see all the beds. So here's the left side bed. This that's folded down, that is the sink. This is your propane stove that actually sits there and connects to that gas. It works fine. You can get another stove. We upgraded to a griddle, um, but the stove does work. Here is the dinette area that's folded out into another bed. And here is your right side bed. Here is your cooler with a constant drain hole. So as your ice melts, you're not having water build up. We installed some LED lights, but when you plug into shore power, those lights work. And you've got a little pop-up roof. Electrical outlet inside, fire extinguisher, safety. Again, the door handle works from the inside. You can continue to use it like that or replace that little part. I think it's probably gonna cost you like 10 bucks. Uh, that's it. Asking about 1200 which is much less than the market value of this particular pop-up. Enjoy your Sunday.